What's up and welcome back to my channel. My name is Akosia Behene. If you're new, you're welcome. If you're a tennis subscriber, hey boo, what it do? <laughs> now in today's video, I am gonna be sharing with you guys uh, what is in my diaper bag. If you're excited for the video, please give it a thumbs up. Did I say thumbs up? Give it a huge thumbs up if you're excited for the video. I'm going to be sharing with you guys everything that I keep in my diaper bag realistically. If I'm going out with baby, if we have to go for a doctor's appointment, or usually that's the only thing that we're going for. So I'll be showing you guys everything that I carry along. And yeah, if you're interested in the video, please keep on watching and let's get into the video, guys. I'm excited. <laughs> So if you're seeing this video for the very first time, or if you're seeing me for the very first time, my name is Akusia again. I am a mom. I'm a mom of two. I have two girls, but I recently just had the second one who is two months old now. And this video is mainly what's in my diaper bag for a newborn. So it's not for my older kid, it's for the newborn. So everything that I'm going to be showing you are things that I carry for my newborn baby. And like I said, she's two months, so she really doesn't need much. So let's start with what diaper bag I use. Now, fortunately for me, I got this very early in the mail from subscribing to Enfamil. If you know the um, food, uh, the baby, what's it called? The baby food. I did the subscription and it came with this beautiful diaper bag. Oh my God, I almost dropped it. But it came with this beautiful diaper bag and I figured, you know what, I don't have to get a diaper bag. Plus already I had gotten a diaper changing bag or a diaper carrier bag, which I'll show you guys in a bit. But this is the diaper bag that we have. This is what it looks like. It, um, it gives you the option to use it as um, a backpack and then you can also carry it like so, just like a regular handbag or just do this, you know for it just gives you different different ways that you're able to carry the bag that's one thing that i really like about this bag so the first compartments that i'll show you guys is the pocket side that I, that you have on the side so over here what i keep here is usually used diaper um for like when i change her up in the hospital usually that's what Usually I have to change her up in the, in the hospital. So when I change her up in the hospital, I keep that right here. But also what I keep here is this um, diaper bag for like used diaper. I got this from um, Walmart, I think. I don't remember, but it comes in a pack, in, in a pack of like a lot of bags. So I just take some and then I keep that here so that I'm able to keep used diaper in that bag and then keep it here. And over on the other side it doesn't have any compartment but over on the front it has this zipper side that you see here and this zipper side now in this zipper compartment right here i keep pacifier so i have this container that i also got from walmart this is able to house two pacifiers which i really love i hate to just carry the pacifier you know like around there's so many particles <laughs> in the world right now. So I love the fact that I'm able to keep the pacifiers in this container in the bag just so that it doesn't, you know, get messed up with any other stuff. And it's easy for me to find because I know that when I reach this container, I've reached pacifiers. So I keep that here. And then the next thing that I keep in that compartment is my breast shell or my hacker. Now, if you've watched my newborn essentials video, you will see that I mentioned that you need a hacker or a breast shell this is what it looks like so this is just what i put in my bra for when i'm breastfeeding so say i'm in the car and i want to breastfeed usually that's where i breastfeed i'm able to just slide this into the other boob that is not breastfeeding and this collects the milk and then i keep it in a bottle and then we're good to go so i i like to keep this on for even when i'm not breastfeeding you know for when i'm leaking when i'm in town and then i'm leaking or when we go to the hospital and then i feel that i'm about to leak i just put this in my bra and it collects whatever milk and then we're good to go because i don't like to soil myself you know I, 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 you need to be looking cute you can't be having breast milk all over yourself get it together 
and then the next thing that i keep in that compartment will will be this um this i use this is a food container basically hey um what's it called <laughs> supplements supplements con container so the the food that she's eating right now which is the powder basically the milk powder that she's eating right now i keep that in here i really love the idea of this this is from munchkin munchkin is a brand that does a lot of like baby newborn um tools and equipment very very good brand i have a um, my breast warmer i think my what is it called my bottle sterilizer is from them as well as my drying rack is from them so they're a very good brand i'm gonna link them in the description box below but i'm able to use this to keep her milk powder just so that when i need it i pop it up and then i pour in the bottle and then i'm good to go and usually i keep for like two feet in here so i know that exactly two feet should fit in here so i really love this stuff i really love this stuff for on the go so that's what i keep in that compartment as well and then the next thing that i keep here is my headphones or like yeah my headphones for when i'm listening to music or when i want to listen to music or when i make a phone call you know when you have a newborn on hand you barely have like free hands to do anything so i love that type of headphones the bluetooth particularly the bluetooth one so i just pop in my ears and then i'm able to still do stuff with both hands and then the next thing um, that i keep in here will be my lip balm just regular lip balm chapstick whatever you want to call it and this is how the compartment looks like so this compartment has um, three other compartments on the inside and then it has this mesh situation here i know it looks a little all over the place i'm sorry but yeah it has this mesh compartment here which you can also keep any stuff so i keep the stuff in there and another thing that i'm going to show you guys is this bag comes with an insulator it has an insulator on the insides here see right here yeah so when you keep whenever i keep like her food or warm water in here it stays warm for as long as i need it to stay warm which is really good i never knew that i mean i i don't think that i've had a diaper bag that yeah so i'm just saying that this like um feature makes it really nice for me so i think i like it for myself <laughs> and on the inside i keep my big diaper stroke changing pad so this is what this looks like this is from the brand kitty care um, i got this from amazon really good stuff i'm gonna link it in the description box below if you didn't know i have an amazon store so um, i will link it in the description box below but this is from the brand kitty care on amazon this is what it looks like it comes with a diaper bag and then a changing pad which you can detach <gasps> i knew that i was gonna drop something but ignore that but it comes with a, a detachable changing pad what else could you ask for guys so this this um this is what you use to change i mean what i use to change the baby and one feature that i like about the changing pad is if you look at this side it has this foamy situation going on here which sort of gives your baby a like a pillow or a cushion so that um their head is not like flat flat which is safe and nice so i absolutely love that for myself and then this is the diaper bag situation so this is what it looks like so over here i keep just wipes and they you know see the construction that is going on here it allows you to be able to just pop this take out the wipe without having to take out the entire like wipe and like take it out you know like convenience that's what i'm talking about you know and then it has a zipper situation here which i keep diaper rash cream but to be honest i okay yeah i have a used diaper rash cream so let me just show that one to you guys i keep diaper rash cream this is a used an old one and and then i keep diaper actual diapers here i keep about like five here just so that because sometimes you have to change them up and sometimes immediately when you change the baby up like she poops and then you're changing her up and then you think that she's done pooping you are changing her up you take out the diaper and then she poops again 
you know so that you have to use like sometimes you have to use two to three diapers for one change because unexpected pooping is happening so um it's just good to keep a couple of diapers on hand so i like to keep like about five for for a hospital appointment because i know that we're not going to spend in like so much time at the hospital so that's what i have in my diaper bag and then it's attached to this situation and then inside the bag um it's just inside the bag it doesn't have any compartment whatsoever it's just like a free big space so you can put anything anywhere so usually what i keep in here is a huge file containing um documents you know paperwork baby stuff anything that we need for the hospital i always keep it in my diaper bag because i don't want to keep myself I, I don't want to find myself wanting when i get to the hospital i don't want to get to the hospital and realize that i don't have some kind of some kind of paperwork that they need for like her to be a, be treated or to be taken care of in the hospital so you know what i mean i always keep this in the bag just so that i'm good to go and then i have a bed cloth inside here i keep a bed cloth just a regular bed cloth and then oh this is the, the diaper trash bag that i was talking about this is the pack it comes in a pack like that so you're literally able to pull out one bag where you need it so i keep it in here um yeah and then i have a bottle i mean i usually have like two or three for video purposes I, I just kept one in here but i usually have a bottle and for her bottle currently we use the event um this is the event phillips event bottles um these ones are the nipple nipple like ones these ones are the really soft they have very soft nipples and i find that these are the ones that fit her very well and prevent her from getting colicky and like fuzzy and you know how this is the best for feeding her basically this is the best for feeding her so this is the one that i like the nipple the hole in the nipple is perfect for a newborn like i'm not even going to it's so good for a newborn i have other bottles but i don't i don't like the hole that they have there because they feed you know newborns are just drinking the milk so they feed very fast so you need to be able to regulate how much is going in and this is perfect for doing that so i like the event bottles and then another thing that i have is her diaper rash cream which technically has to be in the, di the diaper bag and then i have my purse which i keep ids money um bank cards all stuff like that and then i have another extra bed cloth in here and then i keep um changing clothes i keep two clothes in here two um what's it called onesies i guess yes that's what this is called i keep two onesies in here because babies are constantly um throwing up you know pooping all over themselves peeing you know babies are babies so you don't know when or where you will need these stuff so i just keep them in here um this is just like regular onesies i just keep that in here and i also like to keep saline drops on hand um for days when she's like stuffy or for days when i find that she's gonna need saline drops i just like to keep that on hand um and then yeah that is basically it for my diaper bag that is literally it for my diaper bag i hope i'm not forgetting anything but legit when we're going to the hospital we don't need so much we usually just need paperwork food you know like food paperwork um clothes pacifier we usually don't need so much diaper bag and then we're good to go so um that is what it looks like in my diaper bag so i hope that you guys like this video if you're a mom and you follow me or you're watching this video i'd love for you to comment down below what is your diaper bag looking like or what is something that you keep in your diaper bag that you find that i don't keep in my diaper bag i'd love to know we're all learning on this journey of motherhood that's why i like to call it figure motherhood so please comment down below and also comment down below if you have any video that you want me to create for you on motherhood i'll definitely do that thank you guys so much for coming by to watch this video i love you guys i will see you guys in my next video Bye.